Randy Savage has been called one of the greatest competitors in the history of WWE. And you'll get no argument here. One of the most important superstars in the history of our industry, the Macho Man Randy Savage. Now, the Macho Man notoriously intense inside the ring, but extremely giving outside of it. A true superstar in every sense of the word. One of the biggest names in WWE, The Viper. The Viper won his first WWE Championship at the age of 24, the youngest world champion in history. Such an accomplished career for this young man. But gentlemen, we know that the Viper is at his best when he hunts alone. Methodical, dangerous Randy Orton has earned his spot at the top of WWE. He has beaten nearly every big name, slain nearly every legend. You gotta wonder, what's next for the Viper? Championship, Saxton, and plenty of them. The following contest is a two out of three falls match. That is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Introducing the challenger from Sarasota, Florida, weighing in at 239 pounds, Macho Man Randy Savage. And his opponent, from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 245 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Randy Orton. Who's going to lay claim to the workhorse title here tonight? attached to the Intercontinental Championship. So much weight attached to this match. Yeah. Right now, it's all about living in the present, in the now. That's the only way the champ's gonna get out of this with his title in tow. Side rush and leg sweep. Kicked all the way to the 
floor. Byron, what is tested the most in a superstar during a best of two out of three for the match? This will test you. He's got him down. Is this it? And he doesn't let the pin last long at all. Not even close. A step ahead of Savage. Getting sucked. Stop in the leg. Oh, kick right to the back. Short sure, clothesline. The challenger eating up some damage. Oh, precision knee drop. Merciless attacks from the Viper. And Randy Orton is on a roll here. Slip. Watch the quickness on this. Whipped over in a snap suplex. Look at this. DDT. Kneeling. Mind games in full effect from the Apex Predator. their breaking point. Ooh, that caught with a punch to the face. Ooh, close line delivered. And back elbow creates separation. He's back into the ring. Hooked up. DT. The challenger being outclassed here. These are dire straits for him. He needs to be extra cautious now. The Macho Man needs to stay focused and utilize that trademark intensity to get back into this match. Both well, superstars showing great awareness. Of Savage now starting to bleed. The champ has his one to now. Hangs on the The champion's shock is palpable. The champ 
will have to dig deeper now. That should have been it. Ninety-nine percent of the time it is. Orton is seeing red right now, and he's got more work to do here. Boom! He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. With a loss to the end of the table, fishing for something beneath the ring. He's looking to absolutely destroy his opponent with that chair. something. He's got a kendo stick, a weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. Suplex! Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, he's got the pin. This could be it. Into the pay window. Wow. Somebody better check his nose. Tag! Watch. And Savage showing he has plenty left in the tank. Once again, Savage is swinging the momentum to his side. Can Orton withstand this attack? And Orton from the top rope. These athletes are putting each other through. Left by the turnbuckles. And like a pine, a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. Impressive display of dominance from Savage. And the madness cannot be stopped. Savage now pushed high atop the rope. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Setting foot in the ring now. Kendo stick wrapped around the head. Kendo in hand, that means he's hardcore. He'll take them all. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Evading offense. Not a clubbing blow to the back. Oh, kick right to the gut. Another and Looking for a high-risk, high-reward situation. Perched on the top rope. Nobody home. Scoop slide for the championship. He kicks out before the count starts. What? What? What do you say? This is amazing. What a match. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. the top. That one fails to land. Missed the mark. And he was ready for it. Oh, what a right. Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. And listen to this place. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. The Viper is facing a bit of danger here. Orton Neat. Savage now. Perched high atop the ropes. Stretch. Savage finding himself in deep water and very close to sinking. Oh boy, he is setting up the table, taking this to a whole nother level. Table behind it now, not where you want to be. Gravy! You can literally see his soul leave his body as he crashed through the table. I have no idea how he's going to manage to go on in this one. He changed the McFoley and Edge in WrestleMania, and we know how that turned out. Oh, God. 
What, what do you say? I mean, this, this is this is amazing. Gar scraping over the eyes. He turns it around. And more attacks to his core could hinder the offense. Launches. is worth another look. Here we go. like that. The wherewithal displayed in this match cannot be undersold. They were pushed to the limit and they still came out on top. Yeah, the competition threw everything but the kitchen sink at them here, but who knows, maybe the kitchen sink would have changed the outcome of this match.